वेलकम टू एम डी सी लर्निंग स्टैंडर्ड टी वाई बी कॉम सब्जेक्ट इनडायरेक्ट टेक्स हेलो लर्नर्स टूडे वी विल टॉक अबाउट जी एस टी द इंट्रोडक्शन पार्ट अंडर दैट लेट्स नो अबाउट जी एस टी लॉ जी एस टी काउंसिल एंड जी एस टी एन सो लेट्स गो फर्दर with gst law on your screen you can see a table under that there are five points the law and the purpose of that particular law five acts first one talks about the central goods and services tax 2017 cgst act This particular act's main purpose is to levy and collect CGST on intrastate and union territory supplies. Second is the State Goods and Services Tax 2017 SGST Act. The main purpose of SGST Act is to collect tax on intrastate supplies. Third is comes union territory. Union Territory Goods and Service Tax, two thousand seventeen, UTGST Act, basically deals with purpose to levy and collect UTGST on intrastate as well as union territory supplies. Fourth one comes the Integrated Goods and Service Tax. This kind of tax basically levies on. interstate and union territory supplies last one is basically compensation act this act is gst compensation to state tax 2017 the main motto of getting this particular act under gst is to compensate state for the loss of revenue if any due to introduction of gst these five acts are the most important acts under gst and together it constitutes the gst law if there are any information which is required for gst calculation according to central state union territories then these acts plays a vital role let's go further and see goods and service tax council On your screen you can see the logo of Goods and Service Tax Council. Goods and Service Tax Council is a constitutional body. What is act it actually does is, is it suggest it recommends union and state government on issues related to GST. Goods and Service Tax Council ka main motto yahi hota hai ki वह यूनियन टेरिटरी एंड स्टेट गवर्नमेंट को किसी भी टैक्स रिलेटेड इशू में किसी भी जीएसटी रिलेटेड इशू में हेल्प करे गुड्स एंड सर्विस टैक्स काउंसिल में मेंबर्स होते हैं ये मेंबर स्टेट एंड सेंट्रल के वेरियस डिपार्टमेंट से सिलेक्ट करके लाए जाते हैं द मेंबर्स बेसिकली आप the union finance minister is the chairman the union minister of state in charge of revenue or finance is the member the minister in charge of finance or taxation or any other minister nominated by each state government are the members they gives recommendation to union and the state governments for any change or corrective steps In second point on your screen, you can see that Article two seventy nine, subsection A, clause one of the Constitution empowers the President to constitute a joint forum of the Centre and State. This is basic. Uh, this is constituted by the President, and uh, the that particular Constitution, that particular forum, consists of a people from a Central and the state department now on your screen you can see the gstn gstn is a networking system it is basically a non profit non government uh, company 
this is just a kind of outsourcing where 73 IT companies assist the government in taking important uh, taxation system and uh, basic decisions about uh, networking. Goods and service tax network has been set up by the government as a private company under section 25 of the Companies Act 1956. Initially, the central government held 24.5% stake in GSTN while the state government held 24.5%. The remaining 51% was held by non-government financial officials or financial institutions. Uh, this particular council held his first meeting in 4th May 2018. What happened in that day is that government needed some outsourcings which can help the government in taking and taking further the GST and system of networks. So what service providers government decided is Infosys has been appointed at managed service provider MSP. So Infosys ko appoint kiya gaya ki wo jo management hai service providing ka wo manage kar sake. Iske alawa, Infosys ke alawa 73 IT companies ko select kiya gaya jinme kuch major company hai CCT of Karnataka GST Suvidha Providers GST would develop application to be used by taxpayers for interacting with the GST in. So these are the things which were most important and GST and Aya Jisne uh, GST ka process hai, usko hi jada easy kar diya. It will be interface between the government and the taxpayer. Yani mediocre ki tara. Government or taxpayer ke beach mein ek mediocre ki tara hamara GST and work karta hai. Aur kaun hai wo mediocre? Kaun hai wo middle people? They are first on a top is Infosys who works as a managed service provider. Aur uske baad aate hai 73 IT companies. Jo hand to hand kaam karte hai government ke saath taxpayers ke saath connect honi ke liye. Now on your screen you can see GST in kya kya karta hai. So it is basically focuses on these things. Apart from these things it also focuses on various other. But aap uh, screen pe apne dekh sakte hai. Ek chote se diagram se bataya gaya hai GST in registration, chalans, refunds, returns, audits, appeals. These are the basic and most fundamental works of GSTN. Let's go further. Thank you students for attending today's lecture. I see you in next lecture.